Charlie, your immediate thoughts after the game? Yeah, frustrating. Um, obviously, with Wraith losing today as well, it's it's a major let off for us, and we all know that we've incredibly fortunate from the way we played today. I think we just weren't ruthless enough in, in both boxes. Um, the goals we conceded, I think we all as a team know we can do better, and I think we had chances to win the game, or even well, as I said to you, we were we started the second half well, two one, and. If we don't concede that third, I think we go on to get an equaliser and then you never know, we've got half an hour, 40 minutes to go and get a winner. So, yeah, it's bitterly frustrating. David Mitchell certainly added to that frustration today by Mac out in at least five great saves today. Yeah, and taking his time at every goal kick possible, but um, we'd do the same as well. But yeah, he had some really good saves and on another day maybe we would have um, won the game, but I don't think we deserved it at all, so we got what we deserved. Kept your composure for the penalty? Yeah, um, obviously I missed against Wraith in the Challenge Cup, so I knew just focus, take my time. I don't think I took my time that one and took a deep breath and just made sure I focused on my technique and that took over. And that point, you sort of give us a, a sort of lifeline to, to hold on to. Yeah, and we all we went in at half time. It's a mixture of frustration and a bit of optimism that it's it's two one. They're going to be frustrated that they've conceded just at half time and we've got ourselves back in the game so we came out in second half and cracks and lead told us in no certain terms that we have to go and prove ourselves so we're playing for a big club that shouldn't be in this league we should be in the league above and the league above that um so we had to go out and prove ourselves and i think as we did the first 10 well, i don't know when they scored in the second half but up until then we we're getting in behind them we had a few chances at the bar and stuff so yeah really really frustrating are you sir as our are you as surprised as the fans, the fact that there were three chances within the first three minutes of the second half and it seemed like every one was, was net-bound? Yeah, yeah. Um, can't remember them all particularly, but um, I remember I got in behind one and we nearly got a cross shot uh, cross across the goal. And Yeah, another day maybe we'd have gotten the end of them, but as I've said a few times now, we didn't deserve it and we got what we deserved. To what extent now do the guys just simply need to put it down to, to a bad day at the office and try and, and move on to the next game? Yeah, I think you have to be honest with ourselves and everyone in there is looking at each other and think we didn't reach that man, didn't do enough. And we've been lucky with the result going our way, so Tuesday's a massive. We've been really successful under Lee and Cracks so far this season and there's no point in, yeah, accepting that it wasn't good enough today but not being too down because we're still in about it and if we go and win on Tuesday and go and build momentum then there's no reason why we won't maintain being at the top. And that's thing, although the defeat is always disappointing, what you're saying, something that you picked up on there was, to what extent is that maybe a, a reality check for everyone, just to say, you know, we are going to have to be at our best if if we want to get out of this league? Yeah, definitely. I think there's a difference between staying in a league and pushing for playoffs. and But going and winning a league, you have to be consistent and you need everyone needs to be at it. And if you're not at it on the ball, you need to be at it off the ball. And maybe we weren't today. And I don't think we were focused enough in certain areas. And... Yeah, it's a learning curve and as, I, as I've said, we're fortunate with the result going our way that we've got a massive game on Tuesday and everyone's ready for it. And just finally on that game on Tuesday, it is still thankfully because of that result still in our hands. Um, if we are to go to Kirkcaldy and get the win, what's going to be the, the key to the game? Everyone been at it, uh, as I said, I think today we weren't. Um, and I just think, I believe we need to believe that we can go and win there and I think we do. Um, not to get too low and not to get too high, I think that's biggest thing in a title challenge so yeah I think we'll just go have a good recovery day tomorrow, train well Monday and be fighting fit for Tuesday. Charlie congratulations on the goal today and as always thanks for your time. Cheers, thank you. Good. Well,